in the previous video, part one, we ended off with this fact that if we have flaws or inconsistencies with our character, like I do, you know, then we can change. Everyone has the logic and the ability to change. But this phrase, you know, this concept of having the ability to change is thrown around everywhere you go. You know, your parents will say it to you. You will read it in books. You will watch it in videos. But then, then we ponder over how can we change? And we'll raise our hands and do dua. And we'll say, Ya Allah, you know, how can I be a better person? But the, the truth is, is that when we gradually do good deeds, that is when true success comes. And the reality is that everyone has the ability to change themselves. Why? Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala did not choose you to be a loser. No, He did not send you into this world to lose. No, do you think that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Al Wadud, the all loving, would have sent you into this world to lose? to be average, to be mundane. It is not an accident or a coincidence that you are where you are. It is only by design. And Allah Azza wa Jal has brought you through certain experiences in your life so that you may be equipped to be a successful individual. The question is, brothers and sisters, is what have you shown Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so far in your life? You know, what greatness have you shown Him? What have you done to prove that you love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? You know, and when we ponder over these questions, and in Ramadan, this special month, we have the opportunity to do that, then we will know how to change. Don't be weak, brothers and sisters. Be strong, be logical, and be brilliant, inshallah. Jazakallah khair.